FGH spoilers tease that Alexis will receive the devastating news of Sam's death while she is incarcerated, and this news will completely break her down. Feelings of pain and guilt will immediately flood Alexis's mind as she realizes that her hasty decision to throw away the gun led to her daughter's tragic death. Not only has she lost her beloved child, but being unable to be with her family during this time of grief makes Alexis feel even more alone and hopeless. In the cold, isolating prison environment, Alexis is overwhelmed by a mixture of chaotic and helpless emotions. Not being able to attend Sam's funeral, not being able to hold her daughter one last time, will push her into a state of complete breakdown. Every moment in prison becomes unbearable as Alexis is haunted by the thought that she is responsible for this tragedy. The immense loss and deep sorrow may push Alexis to the brink, where she sees no way out, out, leading her into an unpredictable mental crisis. Alexis was sentenced to life in prison for John's murder, and this sentence has pushed her life into a dark, dead end. She will have to face the harsh reality that she will never leave the cold prison walls, forever losing her freedom and life outside. Although Alexis has always maintained her innocence, the evidence against her is overwhelming and the legal system offers her no chance of redemption. Despair begins to consume Alexis as she realizes that not only is her life cut short, but she has also lost the chance to make amends with her family, especially her daughters Molly and Christina. Being locked away forever means she can never atone for her past mistakes, and the separation from her loved ones makes Alexis feel more alone than ever. In prison, Alexis faces not only isolation, but also the deep grief of losing her daughter, Sam McCall. The combination of guilt and despair makes her feel trapped in an inescapable spiral. The life sentence is not just a physical punishment, but a mental one, imprisoning Alexis in the memories of her past and broken dreams for the future. After accepting her fate in prison, Alexis formed an unlikely alliance with Heather, creating a power duo within the prison's underground world, Initially, Alexis was simply seeking survival and a bit of power to navigate the situation, but when she saw Heather's ruthlessness and influence inside, she realized that this could be an opportunity to not only protect herself, but also achieve greater goals. Heather, known for her cunning and dangerous nature, quickly recognized that Alexis was not just an ordinary inmate. With her sharp intellect, legal knowledge, and old connections on the outside, Alexis could be the key to helping Heather escape prison. Heather, who had tried and failed many times to find freedom, began to leverage this alliance to achieve her ultimate goal, getting back into the outside world. With her legal expertise, Alexis not only advised Heather on legal strategies, but also helped her find loopholes in the justice system. Alexis used all her resources and former connections to start investigating and working on reducing Heather's sentence, or at the very least, creating conditions for her to be pardoned or released through illegal means. Alexis knew that the judicial system wasn't always perfect, and with her cleverness, she began constructing a detailed plan to help Heather achieve freedom. Things started to take a bolder turn. Alexis used her knowledge and underground influence within the prison to manipulate other inmates, drawing them into the alliance and forming a powerful group. With Heather behind her, they controlled smuggling operations, bribery, and even threatened prison guards to get what they wanted. On the outside, Alexis began leveraging her old connections with powerful individuals to disrupt the system and put pressure on authorities to reconsider Heather's case. However, Helping Heather gain her freedom wasn't going to be easy. Those around them began to notice the shift in power within the prison, and the growing rebellion started to spiral out of control. Alexis found herself sinking deeper into the chaos, gradually losing sight of the boundary between right and wrong. She no longer acted solely for her survival, but also for the ambition of helping Heather achieve freedom. But in the process, Alexis realized she was becoming part of the very criminal underworld she had once fought against as a lawyer. The alliance between Alexis and Heather not only created havoc inside the prison, but also became a major headache for the judicial system and law enforcement. Things were reaching a boiling point, and if Alexis's plan succeeded, Heather might be set free, causing a major shock outside the prison. But the question remains, can Alexis control the storm she has unleashed? 
And if Heather gains her freedom, what destruction will follow for those left behind?